Good morning and happy Monday, guys. This video is going to be a little different. I am going to show you how to apply lip scents. And I'm also not made up like I normally am. I just have some powder on, no other makeup, and I'm in my leggings and my tunic. This is me in real life every day. Dogs are barking in the background. Zoe's already barged in once. This is my life. I'm a real mom <laughs> with real chaos, and I still love to wear makeup. So let's get started. First of all, you shake, shake, shake. Okay, and I know you're probably thinking, I don't need a tutorial video on how to put on lipstick. I've been doing it my whole life. Well, Lip Sense is a little different, so just bear with me, I promise. I want this product to last on you as long as it's supposed to. And for that to happen, it's important that you do it the right way. So there's no binders in Lip Sense, so you shake, shake, shake. Hear that? That's one of those little balls that's like in nail polish. So shake, shake, shake. Then you, I dipped it. This is bombshell, by the way. And you are going to start from one end and you're going to apply in one direction. You don't go back and forth, okay? This dries very quickly. You want one even thin application, so you go in one direction. If I missed a few spots, I... Okay, that's it. Then you dip again. Even if you think that you have plenty on your wand, I'm going to say it again. If you want this stuff to stay on your lips as long as it's supposed to, you triple dip. Okay? You do three thin layers and you triple dip each time. So you dip one for your bottom lip, one for one side of your top lip, and then you dip again. Excuse my crazy camera work. I need one of those dealios that holds the camera for you. You dip again on that side. And then I smile because it's already drying and I want it to fill in all the lines on my lips and not miss anything. So smile, smile. People are knocking at my door. Now you start again on the bottom lip. You dipped and you're going to go one direction. Okay. I had to pause because my son was banging on the door that it's important because a lip sense package just got delivered and I have to agree that it's important. So then again, I just dipped again. Remember, you don't think, oh, I've got plenty on here. And you're gonna do one side of the lip, dip again. This is really tricky. Ah! <laughs> again, guys, this is real life. So you're going to do this side of your lip. Okay. Now, three layers. So, and you can mix colors and I'll do another video on that. This is just, I'm just gonna do bombshell because I have a basic look today. Again, one layer on the bottom lip, dip, one layer on that, and I'm smiling, I forgot to smile. I'm smiling to fill in the lines. And this is my last layer. Smile, smile, smile. Fill in those lines. Okay, then I take my gloss. I'm gonna use pearl gloss today because it's just what I grabbed out of my bag. You do not have to shake your gloss. And you just put the gloss on. My lips are still a little sticky, but they're drying. Um, you just put your gloss on like normal. This, you can, your lips are already dry. Your color's already dry at this point. Look, already dry. So it doesn't matter how you put on your, oh, your lip gloss. Put it on how it makes you comfortable. You don't have to smack your lips together. Even though we're used to going, your color's dry. It's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to spread. You're done. This is now applied for the rest of the day. Now, if my lips start to get dry or I want them shiny, I'll just apply the clear gloss throughout the day. That's it, folks. I'm good for the day. My simple mom look of leggings and tunic <laughs> and powder and pretty natural lips are done. This is it. This is bombshell. This is one of my favorite natural colors. This is the one that Jennifer Aniston wears and we see all the pictures of her in. It's pretty.